Welcome in, everybody. It's the coach. This is Madden 20 on EA Sports. We are just moments away from what should be an excellent matchup between the Los Angeles Chargers and the Kansas City Chiefs. With that, we're off to Arrowhead for the call from Kansas City. We'll hand it over to Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. Okay, Coach, EA Sports coverage of the NFL has us in a very rainy Kansas City, Missouri at Venerable Arrowhead Stadium. A few short moments ago, these two teams made their way out of the Arrowhead Stadium tunnels, and the noise level in this place was just about off the charts. They're set for football as the Chiefs get set to do battle with Phillip Rivers and the Los Angeles Chargers. Brandon Gordon, Charles Davis, happy to be with you. And Charles, we've got two teams who know each other extremely well. These division games, they tend to be battles. People scout like crazy in this league, but no one scouts more than within the division. Because if you win your division, you're automatically in the playoffs. That puts extra emphasis on these games, and they can't wait to get at each other. Here's the kicker, Harrison Butker, ready to get this one started. And we are underway from Arrowhead. This fielded at the two. And he'll take this one near the 25, call it the 26-yard line. First carry from Melvin Gordon. And that's not the start that he was looking for as he's going to be met and dropped behind the line. It'll go as a loss of a yard on the game's first play. Second down. A loss of a yard there to start out. That leads to a second and 11. Play fake to Gordon. Now Rivers. And he's taken down. A cheap sack. Two plays so far, a run and a pass attempt, and both have gone backwards. Probably not how they drew that up. Not at all. <laughs> Looking for a better play coming up on third. Rivers. And this is caught. First catch for Keenan Allen. They get seven there, but it brings up four. But we hear so often how tackling has become almost a lost art in the NFL game. But it's so important to tackle well on these receivers, especially in a play like this one. Third down, they gave him the underneath stuff. You got to go up and make the tackle right away. And it's fielded at the 34. So a change of possession here on the punt. And that will come the offense as they take over. The Chiefs in good position to start out as they come up first and 10 at the 45. From the gun, it's Mahomes. And this will be incomplete. Physical play on the football there, and it's second down. Nice play there to force the incompletion. And to me, one thing's for sure. When you're the underdogs and you're playing on the road, you absolutely have to get takeaways. You've got to get the ball from them. Yeah, win that turnover battle going to be key. They didn't get one there, but you get the feeling they keep making plays like that. They might just get a few. Yeah, once you get one, defensive teams think they come in bunches. From midfield, here's Mahomes. And it's knocked away and incomplete. It's a great job by this secondary. When I watch them, they remind me of elite defenders on a basketball court, right? They want to contest each and every pass. Great contest on third down to bring up four. And it's complete to Kelsey. Travis Kelsey. And Kansas City touchdown. Travis Kelsey, 50 yards. As his guys are able to strike first here in this opening quarter. That certainly went against the traditional ways of playing football, but who cares? Look at the result. Big touchdown. They went for it on their own side of the 50. So there's conservative, there's aggressive, and there's really aggressive, which is what we just saw there. Tip of the cap to them. Footing always a concern, but the extra points up and good. And it's now a 7-0 game. A drive there of just four plays. And it winds up with the Chiefs hitting pay dirt. Now after the touchdown, here's Butker on to kick it away. 
This one taken from the seven. And he'll bring it a few past the 20 to the 23 yard line. The Charger drive about to get going. And on the first drive, three and out. And I know that these are professional athletes, but I would imagine sometimes you, you get the nerves at the beginning of a game still, don't you? Those don't ever go away. And typically, what I've heard from guys and what I remember from playing, if you don't have nerves at the start of a game, it's not going to be a great day for you. You're not really ready to play. So finding a way to harness those nerves and not let them affect you in a negative way, that's what all the guys are looking for. Up past the 25 to the 26, a gain of five. Now on third down, an extra DB out there for the Chiefs. And the offensive starters here for Los Angeles. I have to admit, I rather enjoyed watching Melvin Gordon's improvement as he's developed as an NFL player because it started for me in college. Every year he was in school, he would add something extra to his game. First year, he knew how to run. He wanted to add pass receiving to his game. The next year, he wanted to add pass protection to his game. Did all of that. That turned him into a first-rounder, and now a front-line NFL back. Pulled in at the 24. That'll go as a 42-yard punt, but a net of 32, they had a 10-yard return. And the offense will take over with a new set of downs. And now here comes Kansas City. And certainly they'll be hoping to hit pay dirt like they did on the last drive. Got the football back, so a chance to go up two scores. And they haven't been tentative at all in this ball game because sometimes you start a game with your script to try and get information out of the opposing defense. How will they play you in certain situations? Sometimes you script to attack. And that's what I'm seeing so far. Meanwhile, they take a shot to start the drive, but this is going to wind up incomplete. To throw once more on second and 10. Mahomes. And they are going to set up shop at the 40-yard line. And Brandon, the passing game for both of these teams is going to be affected as the game goes along. It's not looking like the rain's going to let up anytime soon. So that might mean a few more wobbly passes and wide receiver slips. And this one winds up getting intercepted. And he stopped immediately there. No gain on the play. It'll be second down. Looking to throw on second down. Rivers, he's got a man, that's Keenan Allen. And they'll get to him after a gain of seven to the 47. A second down completion got him seven. Now here's third and three. Now some movement before the snap. And we'll hear from our referee for the first time this afternoon. That was a third and somewhat manageable now, not so manageable. Exactly, because you had a play call on that you felt like, hey, this could go quick, and it doesn't take much to get it done. Now, just start thinking about a little bit of a deeper route type of a call. And with a flag down, he goes down. So they're able to sack him. Now the penalty looks like it could be holding. Let's find out. Kind of surprised they Still accept the penalty. The only thing that comes to mind for me is they want to move them back five yards because they feel good about their defense. But in most situations, you take the down. That, that, that's what counts more. He'll get this to Eckler. And he'll get it up near the 35, right at the 34 here. He'll get a couple yards on that one. And that's going to make it fourth down. Here's Ty Long now. As the drive goes backwards, so he's on to punt it away. After one, seven nothing on EA Sports. Here's Ty Long now, as he's on to punt for LA. His first punt, 45 yards, this looks good as well. This is taken at the 15. A very good return there. Give him an even 20 yards. Here's the Kansas City offense now as they get set to take over. A tale of two extremes already in this game. A touchdown pass on their opening drive followed by an interception last time out. Now it sounds like things balance out, right? What's that, that mythological thing that we do? If you have a candy bar, have a diet soda with it, it balances it out. And we know that's not really true, right? Because the interception, that sting lingers a little bit longer. Got to come out now and put together some nice plays. Throwing again on second down. 
Mahomes. And he'll work it across midfield inside the 45. Good coverage go. downfield go. led to him taking Here off, picking up the first down on a 13-yard run. The last drive, remember, similar situation. He forced a ball into coverage through the pick. He learned better there. Yeah, similar to a golfer that's confronted with a shot that you just can't make. Sometimes you have to take your medicine, as they say, right? Just pull it down, take off, and go. Don't make something worse than what it was. And now a throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. You get a tight end like this, and you know he's used to dishing out punishment, but here, he's one that has to absorb the contact, and as a result, unable to hold on to the football. There goes a deep ball, end zone. Oh, he almost had it for the pick. A great chance there for the interception in the end zone. Instead, third down. Now they face a third and ten after back-to-back -back incompletions. Mahomes now to throw. Forced out to his left. And he's going to get this down near the 30-yard line. And he's brought to the ground with another first down at the Chargers 30. Under the category of obvious, you hate giving up a first down a third and long. And somehow, he finds his way downfield and picks it up. And if you look at the coverage defensively, oh, this is great. But no. in a double coverage, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Casey Hayward. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. The Charger drive about to get going. So far, they've had three drives, three punts. Not good. Not good indeed because you've got to have something to show for being out on the field. Now, sometimes if you have a game where neither side has scored, three punts isn't a bad thing. But when you're trying to set the pace, get up on top in a game, you've got to show better offense and find a way to put some points on the board. On second down, they'll run with Gordon. And nothing doing. He's immediately taken down at the line of scrimmage. No gain on the play, and it's going to bring up a third down. On third down, Rivers. And he's going to find his man out of the backfield. That's complete. And they're going to get the first down here as he's up to the 14. Give him seven yards on the play as they do pick up the third down conversion. On first and ten, Rivers. And his throw is incomplete. It's been my observation. There's been a nice variety of play calling defensively. You and I often talk about an offense's ability to keep a defense off balance with what they're doing. I think the converse has been true in this game. Yeah, I think you're right. They seem to have gone off tendency quite a bit, but only the second quarter, a lot of time to change things. The Chargers on third down. They've only converted once in four tries. This is third down and 12. Two minutes on the clock, second quarter, 7-0 ball game. We remind you that coming up at halftime, we'll pay a visit to Jonathan Coachman. He's in Orlando, and he'll have our EA Sports halftime report. And he'll only get this to the 17, well shy of what he needed. It'll be a gain of five, and the punt team will now come out on fourth down. We often talk of situational football. Let's just call it team football. The defense did their job, got off the field, brought the punting situation, so they're turning the ball back over to their offense. You think those guys will get along very well right now? Of course they will. Defense helped the offense. Now it's their turn to take it downfield. The KC offense out of the huddle, ready for their next drive. And two interceptions already here in this first half. That's got to affect him a little bit, right? He's got to be thinking about it. He's got to be thinking about it, but most of the good ones... They find a way to put it aside. They're not happy about it by any stretch of the imagination. They find a way to put it aside and continue to play their game. Can he put it aside? Let's find out. On second and ten. Mahomes going to let one fly for Robinson. Oh, nearly picked. Yeah, maybe lucky there. This guy doesn't drop many defensively. Third down. So back-to-back -back incompletions, and that has him staring at a third and ten. Working from the gun, Mahomes. And that is incomplete. And it is true. You can draft the fastest. You can draft the most athletic guys. But if they don't know the art of positioning, sometimes it's all for naught. In this case, in the right spot, help force the incompletion. Yeah, but had his hands on it for a second. Would have been a tough catch, though. Falls incomplete. To throw, it's Mahomes. 
and they will not be able to hook up there. It's incomplete. Boy, a real head scratcher there. And the Chargers will get the football back in excellent field position. And partner, I'm not really sure what in the world they were thinking on fourth and long there at this stage in the game, but do you think social media may be firing up a little bit right now? Oh, the coach is trending right now. All right, there's no doubt about it. People are wondering what that decision was. But it takes me back to a number of years ago. A very successful coach in the league had told himself before a playoff game he was going to be aggressive. No matter what, he's going to be aggressive. And it ran his team into some real problems early, and they got upset in that playoff game. Let's see if this team can recover. Well, that's aggressive in capital letters with glitter. Seven underscore. I mean, that's that's the definition of aggressive. Yeah, you can almost hear the cheerleaders doing the be aggressive chant behind him, and he listened to it. And he gets this down inside the 35 before going out of bounds. The completion good for three, and it's second down. That first down completion only netted him three. Second and seven. They try to throw on second down, but this one is incomplete. Keenan Allen, the intended receiver. But now it's third down. So third down now. They need the 27-yard line for a first. To the air again here, Rivers. He's got green. They stop him for only three that time, and that'll bring up fourth down. Brandon, perfect defense in this situation would have meant that there was an incompletion that would have picked it off. Okay, so they gave up the completion. But I really enjoyed watching how the defense stayed in sync stayed in great communication and as he dragged across each zone you see him pointing communicating there he is and they passed him off to each defender ended up making a nice play even though it was complete so we have reached halftime there you have it halftime quickly over third quarter here we go forecast calling for more of the same the rain set to continue as we are underway in the second half this one taken from the seventh The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. They have the lead now. They'll be looking for some separation here as we begin the third quarter. I like the way you turned that because now it's Sammy Watkins. He's going to go. And all the way in for a Kansas City touchdown. Sammy Watkins, 64 yards. And the Chiefs are able to extend their lead. Always important to get the first score of the second half. Now you start to pull away a little bit and get some breathing room going. And now we find out about the fortitude of the group that's behind because they were counting on getting into the game a little bit more, right? Maybe they get the first score. That doesn't happen. It looks almost insurmountable, but it's not. Let's see how hard they play the rest of the game. Extra point right down the middle, and that'll make the score 14 to zip. And we can break that scoring drive down pretty easily. One play, long touchdown pass into the end zone. This one taken from the seven. And a pretty good return here. He'll be stopped just shy of the 25 at the 24-yard line. The Charger drive about to get going. And their halftime hole now even deeper. They need a big drive here just to answer the first touchdown of the second half scored against them. They were down at the half. Now, as you mentioned, they're down a little bit bigger. But no time for discouragement. Just got to get back to it, right? Put your shoulder against the boulder and start pushing and try and get back to where you were to start the half. Play action now. Rivers. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Chris Jones coming right up the gut. Gets in there for a loss of nine. So it's third and long for the Chargers and Rivers after the sack. Here's Rivers. He's going to sling this deep downfield. And that will be incomplete. Well, they weren't scared to let it fly, but it falls to the ground and brings up fourth down. It's been a struggle for him accruing yards in this game, passing the football. So there he said, hey, I'm going to try to chuck it deep, but another incompletion. Has to be a little bit frustrating because of what you just described. It's been a struggle for him here in the second half, hoping for one big shot to get him out of the doldrums. 
And now here comes Kansas City. And following that long touchdown pass, a one-play drive last time, Let's see if the defense, you, you know they're ready. They don't want that to happen again. And you would have thought they would have been ready the last time. I mean, that's what you work on all the time. Make sure that no one gets behind you. That's the cardinal sin of defense, not giving up the long pass. They did. Let's see how they adjust. They're throwing to start the drive, but that one incomplete. An incomplete pass on first down. That leads to a second and ten. Now, meanwhile, a pass that should have been intercepted, but it winds up falling incomplete. Now they face a third and ten after back-to-back -back incompletions. Single, single. Shotgun snap to Mahomes. He is going to find Hill here. And he goes down, but not before getting this inside the 25. A good pick up there, 26 yards. He's such a good route runner. Shows it there on third down. Very proficient and a good pass. And you know what I've observed over the years in the NFL? The better a route runner you are, the more confidence your guy's going to have in you to go to you in important times because he can trust you being in the right spot. And they connected there and picked up a first down. Man, defensively, that hurts. They got him out of his rhythm. They had him hemmed in. But somehow he was able to tuck it away and get away for a gain. Now Mahomes, and that is caught by Watkins for a cheap touchdown. Sammy Watkins, two catches, two touchdowns here so far. And the Chiefs are able to extend their lead. A lot of people might call this backyard football. Sometimes just understanding who you've got out wide and who you're going to throw it to. Give him an opportunity to go up and make a play, even when contested. Looks like that one worked out pretty well. The trust factor, in effect. The extra point splits the uprights, and that makes the score 21 to zip. So that drive spanned five plays, and it's capped off with a Kansas City touchdown. Now after the touchdown, here's Butker on to kick it away. This one fielded at the five. And a good return as he'll be stopped just shy of the 30-yard line. The Charger drive about to get going. These guys had to punt their last possession, and that's become too familiar of a refrain. Too many of these drives just wound up going nowhere. Well, you know how in baseball, when the pitcher gets a base hit and he's on base, they bring his jacket out to him to keep him warm? A lot of times, the punter goes to the sideline and puts on sweatpants or a wrap over his leg to keep it warm. He might need a massage from the trainer right now from all the work he's getting. Rivers, he leads to Eckler on the draw. And he's swallowed up right near the line of scrimmage. Call it no gain that time as it's going to leave him with a third and about three to go. Third and short yardage. Rivers complete. Hunter Henry with the grab. The completion there winds up a wash and it'll bring up fourth down. They dialed up the blitz on third down and your worry is a defense that they can hit you with a big play in that situation. Instead, the blitz pays off. Able to rally to the football and make the play. 46 on his first kick. This one in that neighborhood as well. And we'll see what he can do on the return. It's a 41-yard punt, but just a net of 31 following the run back. Now Sammy Watkins and the rest of the offense getting set to go again. He's been his typical solid and reliable self, hasn't he, Charles? When you have that go-to receiver that you can count on in the situation we absolutely have to have him, and there's nothing better for anybody who's throwing the football. But the best part is the payoff. Two touchdowns already. That's the bottom line when you throw the ball to a guy. Absolutely. Not over 100 yards right now, but he does have the two touchdown catches. Now here's Mahomes. Going to let one fly for Robinson. And nearly intercepted. That would have been a hat trick, his third pick of the game. Instead, second down. So after the incompletion on first, now second and ten. Looking to throw is Mahomes. And that going to be incomplete. A lot of contact, no call, and it's third down. That's very well timed there defensively because it's not a bad throw, but the collision came at the exact time he was reaching to bring in the football. Really, really well done. Decent offense, just better defense. I think you're right. Now a shot taken on third down, but it's going to wind up incomplete. 
I think it's pretty safe to say that when you're up three touchdowns, the last thing you want to do is hang one up there. And how about this, a fake? And this is caught, and the fake will work. He's going to have a first down. Give him an even 20 yards there on the pickup as a fake punt fooled everybody. And I don't know what the method is to know when to dial up a fake punt, when not to, whatever the method there, it worked for him. I think you actually did explain it. There is no method. It's just a feel, a sense, and a healthy dose of guts in order to... And he can't find a receiver, and he's brought down. Melvin Ingram dropping the hammer off the edge. Coming up now on a second and 15 following that sack. Here's Mahomes to throw. Looking middle, and it's incomplete. He was trying to get it into Watkins, and that takes us from second to third down. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. Now throwing on third down there, but he cannot connect. So on fourth down, Mahomes off, Harrison Butker on for the Chiefs field goal. This officially a 55-yard attempt. And that one's not going to get there. Not enough juice, an ambitious effort, but it's well short. And this score will stay right where it is. The Charger drive about to get going. And let's face it, this drive is not going to have any bearing on this game, but it's kind of important for one reason, isn't it? It certainly is. you got to get points. And okay, all right, I'm being facetious here. But you get points, you feel a little bit better about yourself as you move on to the next one. Decent start to the drive, but let's face it, they need a lot of things to go right in a short amount of time down three scores. Yeah, they're going to run their two-minute offense here in this game, but this is for future games. Can they get better and be ready for the next time, hopefully with a chance to win? And he is tackled inside the 40, not quite to the 35. Give him 12 yards there, and the Chargers have a first down. Rivers now, five straight completions here in this second half, first and 10. Rivers on the money, complete. A gain of six there on first. You got the big lead defensively, willing to give them that underneath stuff, right? And this is why you work on your tackling. Tackle them after the catch, inbounds, keep the clock running. Just go ahead and bleed the game out that way. To throw again on second down. Rivers, complete. It's Henry. And they'll get this one to about the 20-yard line. It'll go as a gain of 11 and a Charger first. Finally, a first red zone opportunity for these guys. First and 10 right at the 20. Again, it's Rivers. Oh, he dropped it. And that's pretty indicative of the way this one's gone. Rivers incomplete on first down. Here's second and 10. To throw again. Rivers. He's got his tight end complete. It's green. And he's in for a Charger touchdown. A 20-yard touchdown. And the Chargers are able to close the gap just a bit. Michael Badgley on for the extra point. Quarterback loves the receivers, but sometimes his best friend is that tight end. Yeah, it's hard to believe, isn't it? Because we always talk about the guys out wide and how acrobatic they are. But that tight end... Great sight lines, easier throws. They become a bigger and bigger weapon as the NFL evolves. And the Chiefs are going to make the recovery. Now, fourth quarter, they felt like they needed the football back. Unfortunately, they couldn't get it. And I know we brought analytics into the game, and someone has said here that the data says that when a team's expecting an onside kick, 80% of the time, the team expecting it, they do actually recover the ball, which is what we saw here. I just wonder if that number is much more of an anecdotal type of a number. Kind of like when the coaches tell us, well, when you score on special teams, 93% of the time you win the game. I'm still waiting to see that number is empirical. And this is caught by Watkins. Give him 13 yards there and a Kansas City first down. And he's certainly been a huge factor in this when he's got the two touchdowns to his credit. Now they look to him again. He picks up the first. Yeah, I can hear everyone saying, well, why don't you cover him? Double him, triple him, do what you have to do. But sometimes they get locked into such a groove and such a connection, it doesn't matter how many guys are in his area. He certainly looks to be in that groove right now. 
Brandon, this is clearly a running situation when you're up in the fourth quarter. They're going to have to stack the box and make it difficult for them to move the ball. Made it very difficult right there. Now they need to repeat that effort. Yeah, bring seven, eight, nine, whatever it's going to take to slow them down. And this will go as a gain of seven as he gets it to the 30-yard line. Well, he's proven real effective running the football. No one open, don't force it. Just get what you can, and that's what he's done very well in this game. Throwing now is Mahomes. And a throw there going to be incomplete. Down under two minutes to go in this football game. So the Chiefs in possession of the ball as we welcome you back. And let's see what they've come up with offensively after having time to talk it over. And that is not going to get there. Oh, he missed it short. It's no good. And this score will stay right where it is. Now, if this was a clear day in September, I'd say this is well within his range. I'd feel very confident about this kick, but let's be honest about it. In these elements, the difficulty level gets ratcheted up by at least a factor of five. Now Rivers throw into the hands of Gordon. And to the 42-yard line here and brought down there. Looking to throw again on second down. Rivers. Now the Chargers going to signal for the first of their timeouts as they'll talk it over here before what will be an important third down. Working out of the gun, Rivers. Now a hit, and Rivers lost the football. And it's picked up by the Chiefs. And his guys are going to get the football at the 23-yard line. Well, that drive wasn't a case of wanting to put points on the board. It was needing they to, had it, had having to, to, and they didn't get it done. Yeah, didn't get it done, and now you look at the situation and the point differential, two scores, pretty much game, set, match. How about the takeaway, though, huh? How about those defensive guys? This challenge was initiated by the guys in New York taking a look at the play. Less than two minutes to go. Yeah, I'm sure the coach wanted to challenge it, so he's probably going to send the New York office a holiday card. Now they go for it on fourth, but this one is going to wind up incomplete. They had to go for it with such little time remaining, and the Chiefs will have the football back in excellent field position. First down carry, it's Williams. And just no chance of turning the corner. He can only get back to the line of scrimmage. Second and 10 coming up. Officially nothing on that last run. They'll try again second and 10. Interesting, Mahomes wants to throw it. Steps away to his left. And he's going to keep it here. And a late score here in this one. Defensively by now, you know his ability. You know he has it in him to take off and run. Yeah, because they knew coming into this game, but we've already seen examples in this contest that he can run the football. I think they're going to examine different ways to rush him now. Is it, Are they going to do it with different lanes? Are they going to use a spy? But they have to come up with options because right now, he's hurting them. Butker on for the PAT. A flip to the kicker. He's going to try to run for it. And this fake extra point attempt failed big time. Not only did they not get it, they went backwards. They've got this big lead. They said, forget one. We want two. Instead, they got zero. Unbelievable that he didn't even attempt it from the 15-yard line. What are they thinking? I do know this. When you fake one in this situation with that type of a lead, especially from the 15-yard line, oh, boy. I tell you what, meeting them again somewhere down the line, they'll remember this. Yeah, they'll think that they were trying to clown them a little bit. The Charger drive about to get going. They've lost this one. Their offense has struggled. Do they try to put together something here at the end just to take in the next week? Yeah, sometimes teams want to do that and coaches want to. I remember one time I was on a team and we were losing late in a game like this and you knew it was lost. It was over, right? And the coach called a running play and pretty much said to everyone, 
I want to see something executed well before we get out of here. And that was the message to the team. Just something to build on. Just something to build on, get it done, and maybe we can look at that and say, we'll get better as we go forward. Rivers now, and that will be incomplete. Another incompletion. You know, it's a wonder he's still moving around back there the number of times he's been sacked. Yeah, he's staying out there, isn't he? And you don't think about it much in a game like this, but he's showing incredible leadership. Still competing, still fighting, not taking into a double team, and it's intercepted. It's the honey badger, Tyron Matthew. And they take possession of the football and have it at the 36-yard line. All smiles and high fives on that defensive sideline. That interception will cap off what was truly a tremendous performance. Yeah, if you can hold a team to seven points in the NFL, that's the kind of day that you feel really good about. Now, I do know a few guys are going to think to themselves, held them to seven. If we'd made one more play, we could have had our shutout. Mahomes going to throw it here. Out to his left. He'll try and run it. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. So this one in the win column for Kansas City. And it was their defense that really paved the way to this victory as they allowed the one touchdown, and that was all she wrote. Almost want to do the defense chant right now, right? Defense with a couple of claps in there, but no one wants to hear that from me. Let's just talk about how they got it done, though. When you take care of every aspect of the game, shut down the run, control the airways, right? Make sure the quarterback is harassed. This is the type of performance you get. They can't fashion together any offense, no consistency, and they just took control. That'll do it for us, for Charles Davis and all our hardworking crew. I'm Brandon Gordon. You've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. For more, find us on Twitter at EA Madden NFL. The Chiefs victorious here.